What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel, Game of Thrones, Season 3, Episode 7. Now, last episode ended with Jon Snow and Egret and the rest of the wildlings climbing the wall, which... I'm offended. That's extremely impressive. Your, uh, your accents are awful. <laughs> Never said I was good at it. But that was really impressive. They lost a whole bunch of people. But the boy that is with Bran. Jo Jojen, Jojen. Ha had a vision that Jon Snow was on the wrong side of the wall and he was surrounded by enemies. What does that mean? Do white white walkers show up? Are crows on the other, are, are there crows there that are still defending the wall that- Are those considered enemies because John's a wildling now? Or do the wildlings flip and turn on Jon Snow because they believe that he's still a, a crow? I don't know. It doesn't sound good. I'm worried for Jon because he's basically by himself if like he showed up with the wildlings to the wall he violated his vow to the Night's Watch. Well, he's violated it more than one way. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I mean, they clearly still don't trust him, the Wildlings, because they're questioning his, his information that he's giving. Yeah. And there's still potentially White Walkers out there roaming around. We haven't seen them since episode, what was that, one? Episode two? Mm -hmm. We haven't seen them for a while. We don't know where they are, where they're roaming to. There's but a whole bunch of stuff going on outside of that. Where does Egret go? Does she go I mean, on she with could be, John's side or the Wildling side? She could be playing John as well. I, like I we mean, don't, I don't. We don't think know. So? I mean, I don't. I don't trust anybody in this scenario. We're not supposed to, right? They could be using John to get information at the wall. Who knows? But a whole bunch of other stuff going on. Jamie is getting closer to King's Landing, it feels like. Hopefully, and but Brienne is not. Brienne, it feels like she's going backwards. Yeah, Rob feels like he's got a good plan in place to get back on track for the war. We'll see if that works out, see if the Freys cooperate with him, and if they all agree to the terms that they have presented. It feels like everyone's on board. Fingers crossed, because like I said in the last video, I like victory Rob a lot more than losing Rob. Yes. That's he's way better. Yes. And I'm personally, I think Nikki's been feeling bad for him for a little while. I am warming up a little bit to feeling sorry for Theon. That mm. dude, whoever that dude is, he's a liar. We know that. He is just messing and having fun with him. Holy crap. I mean, just put him out of his misery at this point. Like, it sounds... If you're going to kill him, just do it. Yeah, instead of just toying with but finger by finger, just Ooh. torturing him. It's awful that finger part that was real nasty. it's like such a little thing but like it looked like it was excruciating can you imagine i yeah. mean like even pinch your just your finger not cool no so ready to jump into this episode yes let's go so how you lot do your fighting we march down the road banging drums and waving banners most of the time yes when man's gives a signal we hit castle black and when we banging on drums to let them know we're coming no you're just gonna light the biggest fire the north's ever seen to let them know you're coming you know nothing, Johnson. <laughs> I kind of like it when she says that, though. She's right, I'm dumb. I know you cut me loose on the wall. Cut her loose, too. Do you see her sulking about it? That's because she understands the way things are. And how is that? And are you going to share it with me? People work together when it suits them. They're loyal when it suits them. They love each other when it suits them. Oh. And they kill each other when it suits them. Which is why you'll never hold on to her. So then she's only loving him because it suits her. Well, shit, that sucks. I kind of like them together. Now I'm like, well, screw her then. We have no idea what level of right. trust they have. Who are you writing? Her mother. Does she know the daughter's a queen? Not yet. That would be a surprise, I expect. Many surprises for her. I know she'd love to meet you and her grandchildren. Oh! <laughs> that took a second to hit. You're my queen. I have your little prince or princess inside me. Maybe one of each. Hey, Rob's gonna be a papa. 
But why does it feel like he's not gonna make it there? I don't know, whenever people are happy, bad things happen. I mean, the show has proven that nobody is safe. Right, which is why I'm like, oh, that's so nice, but why does it sound like something bad is gonna happen? You won't love him too much when you find out what he really is. Oh, shit. I want very much for you to be happy, Sansa, and so does my grandmother. Women in our position must make the best of our circumstances. I have to marry him. Has our Tyrion mistreated you? No, he's a Lannister. Far from the worst Lannister, wouldn't you say? True. Your son might be the Lord of Castle Rock and the North someday. Tyrion may surprise you. From what I've heard, he's quite experienced. And um, that's a... <laughs> it can be. They're very complicated, you know. Pleasing us takes practice. My mother told me. <laughs> oh, I love them together and I just want to hold child. her. Poor she's Sansa. She's taller than you. A tall child. You're a lord, she's a lady. Shay isn't going to make it. Shay is a whore. How did marrying a whore work out for you the first time? All right. I should never have told you about that. Man, being a person of importance is like stressful. Shitty. It's real <laughs> shitty. He just doesn't have miss it. Like Bron doesn't have to worry about any of this stuff. No. He doesn't have to worry about m being married to a child. <laughs> no. He, he's golden. Ah, Turd King back in the throne. What up? A little psychopath. I hope everybody's noticed that Joff is in the comment section of all of our videos. Correcting me up. I'd like to report on the meetings of my small council. You're welcome to attend the meetings of your small council, Your Grace. You've been holding the council meetings in the Tower of the Hand. The walk from those here would take time. So if I wanted to attend a council meeting, I would now have to climb all the stairs in the Tower of the Hand. Put him in his place, please. Please smack the shit out of him. We could arrange to have you carry him. <laughs> <laughs> you little shit. Tell me about the Targaryen girl. How do we know these dragons are just curiosities and not the beasts that brought the whole world to heal? We have been told as much by the many experts who serve the realm by counseling the king on matters about which he knows nothing. But they haven't been counseled. You are being counseled at this very moment. <laughs> you little shithead. From now on, I will see to it that you are appropriately consulted on important matters. He needs to realize he has no Never control. Necessary. What are you going to do? Have your a grandfather killed? Your grace. Tywin is in full control. He's like, you little shit. He's in full control. Look at him. He's like, don't. Talk to me like that again, yeah. you stupid little shit. Joffrey has no control over anything. No! He's just sitting there, looking all pretty. <laughs> Taking the city will not bring you any closer to Westeros or the Iron Throne. How many slaves are there in the crowd? 200,000. Oh, shit. And we have 200,000 reasons to take the city. What is her focus here? Saving slaves or going to get the Iron Throne? Damn, she wants to mess up the city. Okay, free. but slaves want to be free. She's like, be free, but if you want to fight for me, I will take you. Yeah. So, I love her for It that. seems dangerous though. Extremely, but... but they have 200,000 slaves. How many people do they have there? <laughs> right? Well, I mean, is the entire city slaves then? Yeah. Oh shit, look at her dragons. Oh shit. You are in the presence of Daenerys Stormborn of House Targaryen. Queen of the Andals and the First Men, Khaleesi of the Great Grass Sea, Breaker of Chains and Mother of Dragons. She's got all kinds of nicknames. You may approach. Our empire was old before dragons stirred in old Valyria. Good. Now we The wise masters of Yonkai have sent a gift. 
I like it, the Silver Queen. Sail them back to Westeros where you belong and leave us to conduct our affairs in peace. Wow. You will release every slave in Yonkai. Reject this gift and I shall show you no mercy. We are Yonkai and we have powerful friends, friends who would take great pleasure in destroying you. Perhaps we'll make a slave of you as well. Uh, you better watch yourself. Me safe conduct. Take the gold. They're like, oh hell. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> That's Drogon. So dope. Aw, purring. That is so dope. I love that. The hell? Uh, are those sunken ships? That's a really cool looking effect, whatever is going on. It's but yeah, those are definitely terrifying. sunken Those are definitely sunken ships. Oh, are they near That's King's so Landing? The hell? Never had a father. Never wanted to be. Oh yeah, he doesn't know. I wonder where your strength came from. I don't, yeah, I don't think so. Your blood is noble. You say, my father, he was some lord of... There, your father's house. <laughs> Just a bastard. Oh no. Of the king. The bastard of Robert of the House Baratheon. Yeah. First of his name, King of the Andals and the First Men. He's like, holy shit. Yeah. Do you think he believes her? I think so, yeah. <laughs> he looked pretty like excited about that. I didn't like giving up the boy. But you did. You took the gold and you gave him up. The red god is the one true god. But he commands we obey. He's not my one to go. Who's yours? Death. One day you'll understand. But no. Oh shit, Arya. I get why she's feeling like this, but she can't be out by herself. No, I mean, especially with Lannisters around. Like the Brotherhood would have kept her safe. At least we, I, mean, I, I think I, I they would. Think so. Ah oh, oh, shit! And now she's with the frickin' Hound. Ah, oh, it's not good for her at all. Oh my God, Arya. Captain Stark released you. We both made a promise to her. I won't return the Stark girls to their mother. I swear it. Alive, though. Alive. Oh no, does this mean he's gonna go back into like... He's been so good with her. She brings out the best in him. Yeah, is he gonna slip back into like... Shit Jamie mode? <laughs> like too cocky for his own good, Jamie? I mean, hopefully the reminder of his hand not being there will continue to keep him humble. Don't you worry about your friend. We'll take good care of her. He can't, he's not gonna just, he can't just leave her. What now? What are they gonna do now? It looks like somebody's being nice to him, but who is it? Don't you want us to see it? Oh, come on, let us see it. We need to make him feel better. This, this is idea. so this. weird. How, how is anybody supposed to want that? This is clearly some kind of setup for sure. Oh shit. I'm oh, sorry. I'm sorry. Terrible timing. <laughs> Oh my god, are they gonna cut it off, dude? Your famous cock must be very precious to you. Would you say it's your most precious part? What the hell, dude? Please! Please, mercy! Mercy! Please, mercy! What the fuck is that thing? I'm not killing you. Just making a few alterations. No, 
Seriously? Oh my god. Are they gonna cut it off? Is that what that really interesting, scary looking knife was for? I guess, I don't know. Is that a pellet? So wouldn't it? Thank you, ma'am. Winterfell has towers three times that size. Well, I'm Jon Snow and I'm from Winterfell. <laughs> My daddy was a fancy lord and I lived in a tower that touched the clouds. <gasps> oh, a spider! Save me, Jon Snow! <laughs> My dress is made of the purest silk from tra la 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 day. <laughs> I'd like to see you in a silk dress so I could tear it off you. All right. God, I love them together. Let's give each other shit back and forth. Yeah, they're really good. I know your people are brave, no one denies that. And you know nothing. Six times in the last thousand years, a king beyond the walls attacked the kingdoms. Six times they failed. The seventh will be the same. Mance is different. You don't have the discipline. You don't have the training. Your army is no army. You don't know how to fight together. You don't know that. I do. If you attack the wall, you'll die. All of you. Oh shit. You're mine. And I'm yours. Aww. If we die, we die. I thought she was telling I thought she was gonna tell him to bounce. I know, right? It's like you're still a crow, goodbye. Brian needs to find the raven beyond the wall. Oh no, I'm not going back there. Your brother is at Castle Black. That's where we're going. None of you know. None of you have been up there. I had a man once. Bruni his name was. I was his. He was mine, but one night Bruni disappears. I knew he'd come back, and he did. Only it wasn't Bruni. His skin was pale, like a dead man's. His eyes bluer than clear sky. Shit. I don't know how I got the knife. When I did, I stuck it deep into his heart. I had to burn a hut down with him inside. <laughs> Meant the North was no place it meant to be. Not anymore. Shit. Can I listen to her now? Well, but Bran is, has visions, like... What's the purpose of an no hand? That sucks. Well, we've started with the corruption. How many lives have you saved? Half a million. <laughs> Half a million. Population of King's Landing. Lord Silver and Tarth offered 300 gold dragons for his daughter's safe return. The lock won't take it. Oh. He's convinced Lord Tarth owns all the sapphire mines in Westeros. Oh shit. Backfired. Been cheated. She'll be their entertainment tonight. Oh Jesus. Beyond tonight, I don't think they care very much. Damn it, Jamie backfired. Save her from one night. Oh no. Look, he's actually getting upset. We have to return to Harrenhal. When my father sees me, the first thing he's going to ask is what happened to my hat? And I'm going to tell him, this man chopped it off. I had no well, I could tell him, this man saved my life. Wow. He really cares about Brienne. And I love that. Damn it! Like, confliction, you know? Like, good, bad. But, I mean, I've seen this comment. People are in the gray, and it's true. Like, this is, it's just such a gray area. What the fuck? Seriously? Oh my god. How could you do this to Brian? I mean, that bear is amazing. <gasps> no! No! What the hell is he doing? Oh my god. Oh shit. It's fucking. Now I'm more conflicted. I don't want the bear to die. Damn it. Oh, shit. Oh, my 
my god. Oh shit. I thought she was toast. I thought they were both toast. One last dig. Just, oh my god. Man, this show is stressful. It is stressful. I'm stressed. I 100% thought Brianne was dead. But I love Jamie right now. Alright, so that's episode down. And they continue to build Jamie up as a good person. I mean, how can you not think he's a good person? Yeah. He went all the way back. He was like, he could have just been gone home. But he went back to save her because... Yeah. I mean, there is no question that... He cares about her. He cares about somebody. Yeah, and you're always going to carry... And this is how redemption and turns happen with characters. There is... I think I said this to someone in the comments. If you could redeem Darth Vader... I think Jamie Lannis Lannister is redeemable. I mean, True that. yeah, he threw Bran out of the window, but he didn't die. Like the kid is still living. Okay, and it's like yes, but that's he, horrible. He threw the kid out of the the window with, with intent, intent to, to kill. kill. Yes, with intent to kill because he was doing his sister, doing a whole bunch of terrible stuff, and he's been a huge asshole. I'm not saying I'm completely on his side. I'm just saying that the actions. They're writing the actions into the show to make you want to like him. Yes. And it's working. Yes. <laughs> They're doing a good job because he's such a good character. He's a huge asshole, but he's got a lot of redeeming qualities now. He's showing that he's got compassion for someone else, which is a huge deal. That's a big deal. Somebody mentioned some uh, wrestling terms in the comments about, like, a shoot? Yeah, so... Someone asked if the whole situation with um, Jon Snow is a work or a shoot. Whether, oh, whether it's real or it's... That. It's basically, is it real or is it fake? Is it a work, which means he's playing them, or is it a shoot, he's really with them? Oh, I think it's a work all, or it all could be, day. Or it could be a work shoot. <laughs> you could combine the two, which means he's kind of just ad-libbing and doing his thing, not really Until sure. Until he becomes one of them? Yeah, which is kind of how I answered it. Well, no, he just doesn't know what his plan is yet. Um, cause he is kind of winging it. It feels like he's now worried about them That's and true. warning, warning Egret that they're all going to die, that the wildlings and, and that group of people fail when they attack the wall and because they can't fight right, together. They don't have the organization and the discipline to fight an actual army, which makes, makes sense. sense. <laughs> so that's why I called it a work shoot because I don't think he fully knows. I think it's, they, they wanted to implant him in there for a reason and now he's just kind of like okay well he's here now so he's gonna do what he needs to do to survive whether or not his plan is to stay with egret or to stay with them who knows i don't know i don't think he knows so that's the whole work I think, shoot i mean thing. he wants to be with her yeah i think he likes her for I sure mean, that whole like we 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 die we die but live first I, what is that all gonna mean? Right, it's, it's, I'm sure we're gonna see it play out very soon. But that was, that felt like a really kind of chill, with the exception of a bear attack at the end. I know, end. what the, what did you get a bear? <laughs> this felt like a really chill, kind of like quiet before the storm type of episode. I don't know why. I mean, we've grown to understand what happens at the end of seasons, obviously, um, based off of season one and season two. Um, and we're getting close to that hot zone. <laughs> Because next episode's eight, and episode nine, both season one and season two, episode nines have been straight fire. I mean, Ned's death, and then the battle at Blackwater Bay. Who the hell knows what's coming? Um, but yeah, like Sansa is in a horrible position in terms of her mind. I know, but there's so many worse people she yeah, could end up with exactly. than Tyrion. Tyrion is such a good. Person. She's not gonna. She's not gonna be hurt by him. He's not going to upset her or hurt her it's just not the life that she dreamt when she was a little girl living in and i you know in winterfell same yeah so <laughs> i mean the last thing she wanted was someone that was this tall and 
you know, older than than her and not a prince of some sort and not a Lannister. Yeah. Um, well, I mean, but... That, there's a whole that, lot of yeah, things I, playing into this that she doesn't like. I mean, she seems really tall, too. So it's probably a little awkward for her. Well, she's the tall child. Yeah. <laughs> so I get why she's upset, but at the same time, bright side, he is probably the best of the bad situation and bad options That's to be gonna with. That's going to happen yeah. for her, yeah. I mean, and uh, I don't know if I should trust Marjorie or not. I, she seems way too cunning to be able to be trusted. She's saying all the right things, which is always dangerous. I may, everybody makes me nervous. Yeah, everyone. I mean, I mean, every time Marjorie is speaking to someone, she's saying exactly what she needs to say, which tells me she ain't being real. She's BSing a lot of people, and she's got the most important person wrapped around her finger, which is Joffrey. I hope he's wrapped. Which is, which was also a great scene watching Tywin just basically just punk him. Right. That was great. I like that he was standing over. Yeah, Joffrey. we're talking to you, Lord Joff. Yeah. Out there, we King, know we King, know you're watching. King Joff. King Turd. <laughs> but yeah, like I mean. Joffrey has to understand that he's not calling the shots anymore. It's just funny, like, Tywin's like, yeah. Exactly. Uh-huh, whatever you think. Yeah, he's like, we're having the meetings close to my place, so I don't have to walk far. He's like, oh, what do I have to? We'll carry you. It's like, shut up. I know, you little shit. <laughs> what else? Anything else in this episode? Uh, sucks for Shay. Yeah, I mean. She's just a funny whore. Yeah, it sucks. But again, she's like, again, best case scenario, she could have been stuck with someone who's really a big giant asshole. Instead, like, he still cares for her. He doesn't. He like, wants Tyrion to wants to take care of her. It's just He's she. No one is happy with this situation. Yeah, exactly. And that, that you gotta Except look. Except for Tyr uh, Tywin. Right, because he's gonna get control of the stuff that he wants, so. I like that, um, did y'all like my notes? Everybody liked the notes. It's a lot of notes. Everybody liked my description of Roz, the horror of yeah. Baelish. You need to erase that and put King Turd next to Joffrey's name. Perfect. King Turd. All right, anything else? <laughs> Make a little pile up. While her. Nikki is adjusting her notes to be <laughs> more accurate, that will do it for today. Leave those comments below as always, like and subscribe. Become part of the growing sticker fam. We love all of you. We appreciate everyone that comes to our channel, likes and engages, and we'll see you guys next time. Oh, quick update. We've got an episode of Westworld and Fear the Walking Dead is back on Sunday night. So we will have one episode of each of those coming up. Maybe if you're lucky and we're feeling it, we'll do an extra Game of Thrones episode, no promises. But we'll see you guys later. Have a good one, bye. For our extended reactions to Game of Thrones, check out our Patreon in the link below.